Hi, this is Eric with Temperature Branch. I was asked to do a review on the Hasbro um, voice changing helmet compared to a um, screen accurate um, New Hope helmet. So I'm going to compare it to the Trooper Expert uh, New Hope helmet. This is an HDPE helmet which was cast from the David M molds. If you want to know about the David M stuff, you can look up on uh, OriginalStormtrooperHelmets.com and they do a pretty good uh, talk about the, the David M helmets. Anyways, this is the Hasbro Voice Changer Helmet. And as you can see, size comparison, they're pretty darn close. Uh, the David M is just a little bit taller um, than this one, but the width they're pretty darn close. I don't know if you can see that or not. They're pretty darn close. Um, this is not a New Hope. This is from Rogue One, basically. And the difference here is it has the embedded tube stripes. These are inlaid. The ears are flat. And the back is inlaid. They're, they're grooves. So, where the ones from A New Hope. These are actually in the movie they're painted on on this helmet they're actually decals but uh, these are also hand painted. I don't know if you can see them and same with these. They're not indented down and the ears as you can see stick out quite a bit more than what that one did. But overall, in a comparison, they're pretty close to the same size helmet. You can see it has a, a bigger um, undercut on this one compared to this one. It depends on which helmet you're looking at. Brian R has a little steeper than the David M. Look at the back. They're pretty darn close actually. As far as size and shape, this one has a slight tilt to it, which is normal because they're not a symmetrical helmet, where this is made a little more symmetrical. So if you go on to the other side, again, the difference, the ears are different, the tube stripes are different, these are different, um, the ear here is a little bit um, rounder and there's no screws or simulated screws on this. This is a simulated brow or this is a rubber brow. This has a hard acrylic lens. This actually has a film lens, a real paper thin film lens. I don't know if you can see in there. It's just, you can probably hear it. It's paper thin where this has all the mechanisms, a headliner, has a little microphone, a nose piece, and, uh, everything else is basically attached. The, the vocoder on these are actually a separate piece also compared to these um, ABS and HTPE cast helmets. So anyway, that's the quick rundown on those. Um, as far as size and shape go, they're they're pretty darn close. Um, I, I might do one on the this compared to the RS helmet, and you can see how that is. That's another screen-used helmet. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. I'll see you in the next video.